welcome to my channel learning with fun i have prepared a note on abhigyana sakuntalam act 4 and this is for ba english honors uh, semester 5 this is the prescribed part for the semester examination abhigyanam sakuntalam written by kalidasa so now we will start kalidasa was a classical sanskrit author who is often considered ancient indians india's greatest poet and playwright his plays and poetry are primarily based on the vedas the ramayana the mahabharata and the puranas his notable works are kumar sambhavam abhigyana sakuntalam raghuvansam megaduta vikramur bahasiyam he wrote three famous plays among them, Abhikyanam Sakuntalam is generally regarded as a masterpiece. It was among the first Sanskrit books to be translated into English. It means that um, Kalidasa's uh, writings or works are widely famous. And most of the universities we can find the prescribed course of Kalidasa. So, Abhigyanam Sakuntalam tells the story of King Dushyanta. King Dushyanta was the uh, what? King of your uh, Hastinapur. So, Abhigyanam Sakuntalam tells the story of King Dushyanta who, while on a hunting trip, meets Sakuntala and marries her. <coughs> Sakuntala is the adopted daughter of Sej Khanava and the real daughter of Vishwamitra and Menka. But the protagonist Sakuntala is abandoned at birth by her parents and reared in the uh, secluded hermitage of the Sej Khanava. Then your, this is the plot of Act 4 of Abhigyana Sakuntalam. While the Sej Khanava and the other elders of the hermitage are away on a pilgrimage. Dushyanta, king of Hastinapur, comes hunting in the forest and accidentally he spots the hermitage of the sage Khanaba and decides to pay the hermits a visit. However, the king decides to go there as a commoner, not uh, as a commoner. He also stops the chariot farther away to not disturb the hermits. The moment he enters the hermitage, he gets Sakuntala and becomes captiv captivated by her beauty. Then they fall in love with each other and gets married in Gandharva style. They have an affair and soon after he leaves to take care of affairs in the capital, Hastinapur. For the sign of for the sign of recognition, the king gives her a ring which, as it turns out, will eventually have to present it to him. When she appears in his court to claim her place as queen, after some days, Sage Kanava returns from Somatirtha pilgrimage and notes about the affair of Sakuntala and Dushanta. The pregnancy of Sakuntala is also known to him. He becomes happy that she chooses an apt life partner. Then he prepares for Sakuntala's Vedic marriage and sends to her husband's house, Hastinapur. By getting his news, many, uh, sorry, by getting this news, Many sages, many sages come to such canvas hermitage to bless and advise Sakuntala. One day, the anger prone sage Durbhasa arrives when Sakuntala is lost in her thoughts, and when she fails to attend him, he curses her by bewitching the center into for for getting her existence. The only cure is for Sakuntala is to show him the signet um, ring given by Dushanta. She later travels to meet him 
and has to cross a river the ring is lost when sips when it slips off her finger when she dips her hand in the water playfully on the arrival the king refuses to acknowledge her sakuntala is abandoned by her companions fortunately the key the ring is discovered by a fisherman in the belly of a fish and dushant realizes his mistake but it is too late then in the meantime dushant defeats an army of asuras and is rewarded by indra with a journey through heaven on this return to earth yes later dushant finds sakuntala and the son by chance and recognizes then the fisherman's re- retrieval of the ring and the saint survival of his memory revival of his memory on this seeing the same ads much to the dramatic effect so this is about the plot of act 4 so let us know about the some important event of act 4 of abhikyanam sakuntala so act 4 contains uh, the most uh, touching scene in the play accompanied by gotami sargavar uh, sargavara and Sar- sardavata sakuntala is being sent by by sech khanava to dushanta palace hastinapur so this is an important incident of act 4 then she is bidding farewell to the plants trees birds and animals and to her hand in its at the ashram anushua and priyambada whom she has so far treated as her own sisters and whom she has lived without being separated even for a single moment in her life in her life even such kanva is so overcome with emotion that his voice shaker so a emotional scene is also uh, narrating in this uh, act 4 and it is very heart touching when you will read the um, drama the text means you can feel what the emotion it inside the book and in act 4 in abhikyanam sakuntala means at the time when uh, the plants trees uh, the animals birds are bidding uh, farewell to sakuntala at that time everyone was crying were crying was crying and the uh, plants said that that they will not take any food they will not give the uh, what uh, the rive leaves like that and the animal says uh, say that what we will not uh, take uh, water and food for uh, in your absence they are saying like that means very emotional when we will read that so before the next one is before sending sakuntala to the santa's palace at hastinapur kanwa sent the uh, what is the king a message requesting him to accept sakuntala and protect for um, protect her properly considering her mates as virtuous and considering your own high birth written your love for this car the next one is this kanavas relief in the end of the act having sent sakuntala along with the munijanas to the palace of her husband dushanta feels relieved as if from a great debt to great debt to a father his own daughter is a wealth belonged to another man therefore he feels relieved only when he sends away his daughter to the one she is married to so these are the events and um, in the first event i have told you that these are the gotami gotami uh, not chit sakuntala with a great love so gotami sargavara and sardavata these are the people who accompanied sakuntala to her husband's palace hastinapur 
एंड फाइनली दे लेव दे लिव शकुंतला दे आर एंड दे रिटर्न टू द आश्रम्स सो इन दिस वे दिस एक्ट फोर इज ए नेरेटेड आई थिंक दिस इज हेल्पफुल फॉर योर एग्जामिनेशन सो रीड इट प्रॉपरली यू मै गेट सम थिंग इम्पोर्टेंट ही है थैंक यू लाइक माई चैनल सब्सक्राइब एंड शेयर माई चैनल थैंक यू